Welcome aboard. I'm Captain Jake, and we're back with another episode of Order of Battle World War II. We are playing the uh, Red Star campaign, and uh, we're going to get back into the uh, Smolensk scenario. But before we do that, I'd like to welcome everybody back to my channel. I remind everyone that this game was developed by the Aristocrats and is published by Slytherin. So let's go ahead and get loaded back up here. It looks like uh, and 6.1, uh, just in case I, <laughs> I lost it. I don't want to do that. So uh, this is primarily a defensive battle for us, and that's what we're going to continue today, trying to keep them away from our objectives. Um, we're getting in about three turns per episode, only because there are so many units. But um, that's just the way it is for this time. So we'll just take a look at this secondary objective. We've destroyed uh, two of seven. Like I say, like I said, uh, we're not worried about secondaries. Well, we never want to lose Volinsk, which we beat back a uh, heavy push here. So that was good. And then we want to hold a retake. These four or six, they're actually six objectives, but uh, I think we're holding four or five right now. So it's that one. Uh, uh, Golf. Oh, maybe. Don't know what the name of that one is. Doesn't have a name, but that is one. And then down here, Hochinko. And uh, Raslavi. That's the one we're really concerned about because you can see they're pushing heavy here. So we're gonna have to see what we can do uh, to slow them up. So let's just take a look around the battlefield. They're heavy pushing here, but I'm not sure what's coming behind them. Here they're attempting another breakthrough right here. We're trying to hold them off and they're coming on the side here so we're gonna have to pull back same here pushing this way and when we can eliminate this unit uh, they've we're going this way then they're redirecting they're trying to come south so we'll see how that works out for them and for us we did break them up here I'm hope I'm hoping that we get some more uh, reinforcements at some point here we're kind of fighting to a stalemate right now uh, but we'll wait and see how that all works out for us um, they got this uh, uh, heavy weapons unit coming down here we got this artillery that can help us and uh, let's see what do we have here oh well we're right done we will go ahead and hit close here we got conscripts we got this infantry units could really use him be reinforced there this is a bt7 we reinforce him that's 14 and this guy is 11 11 and 14 is not exactly what i thought it would be that's still plus five okay what we can do here let's go ahead and do that one These are paratroopers. Okay. Definitely shocked the hell out of them. Don't want to get this this guy cut off, so uh, conscripts here. Just to slow them down. Two, three. lose three I think it'd be better if I moved here let's do this all right let's fall back I'm gonna make him fight through here we're coming down here All right, 
right, that greatly weakened them. That's what we need to see. This paratrooper here, not if they come across, we'll have to wait and see. That's what we're going to do. We could hit these guys. But let's just see if we can slow them down a little bit. And... A 10 anti-tank. Now let's just see what they do. Alright. Now these guys don't know whether I should go on the offensive, but first off, let's see how we do against these aviation units. This units move him here. Let's do that. Move him here. Move him here. Need to kill units. I don't want them. Don't want them busting through you. <laughs> Heavy weapons is keeping them from crossing. He's going to bust through here, though. That's my problem.
him, but um, if I put him out there, it could be taken down by plus. It could. It could. That is 41 infantry. Mm -hmm. Gotta do it. This guy and put him in an airplane. Okay. This guy. Go here. Be seven, six. Should be able to survive better. Right. Oh, took out four, son of a as they would say. Okay, now, darn it. Okay, let's see. Ten. Well, I tried. And uh, no, it's not moving. Definitely not moving. Definitely not moving. I'm gonna leave him in the woods and see what he does. Him his reaction. Nice, if I could have moved him there. Okay. Okay. No. He's there on purpose. But. units. Oh yes, I am in the process of driving this guy around. See what kind of hate and discontent I got. as needed, same so he well he's gonna hold the bridge he's gonna hold the bridge and take damage and he's gonna push him immediately back but my question is should I just say the heck with it and pull him back to here don't allow them to come up here Definitely surround this unit. All right, I'm gonna have to take the hit, I think. All right, that aviation unit is drop him here. I think we're back. Yes, all right. That's gonna be the end of our turn. Now time to take the brunt of their attack. Hold back, but they were going to have to attack. Oh, 
in with him. Oh, I didn't expect him to just kill him. Uh, that hurts. But that's good, though. What he just did was... Only one? That's not fair. At least you took, knocked them down a little bit. Troops to the south. I just don't know where I'm going to get them. supply of all right well nothing has changed here besides us being pushed further back which is an ouch all right 23 so infantry nine Oh, shoot. Wish I hadn't done that to him. We're doing that. Yeah. Knocking him down by only one. may slow him down just a little bit. Okay. Oh, we gotta go back this way. Just slowly busting through on me. Oh, I 
got a chance to take out something here. That's what I wanted to see now. close enough to kill the damn thing since I keep running away. Okay, let's see why I'm moved here. No, he's staying there. He is staying there. Now I'm up here. This group fighting.
Pero no, sí, no, no. Paratroopers out. Nothing against that guy. I die. Fine. He will retreat. I uh, don't need him coming over. Damaged him at all. Right. Let's go. Here. I think we're back around again. Okay. See how badly we get hurt.
Mm-hmm. Here they come with more. weapons. Unbelievable. Yeah, I realize he got wounded in action. Alright. Uh, Crapola. Well, see if we can get him underneath the air umbrella. I know this one guy went around me. One of the areas that I need to protect. Wow, he does a whole lot more damage to me than I could possibly do to him.
Ended there, but Now, Wanted them somehow down here. I don't know how that could possibly have happened, but we did. All right, let's see who else we got to move. He's in position to bombard as needed. him a little bit you take me down to a six take him down to a five that would work no. so he always gets a little extra doesn't he right we'll leave him Need to get him sandbag. Move him there. Really can't move him. I move him up to here. And they come down here. Still, he's still behind me where he ends up going before I... Okay, that's it. All right. Let's go. I'm going to watch him hammer the hell out of me.
Ah, well, kind of knew that was coming. Kill that damn unit, that's all I knew. Holy crap. The good news is that because they pulled that back, we can uh, request these out of the blind. Got another you want to do units blown up, but as they would say, who cares at this point, my goodness. All right, well, what do I need here? Yeah, take all 23 to get him full up. Let's go here. have just stopped right there that's the problem that's exactly correct all right
left him there. Oh, come on! It's bull crap. Unbelievable. Such shit. Unbelievable crap. What's next here? Every weapon. Aren't they fortifying? Barely can hit the bomber. All right, done going around again. See it here. Let's see, we've actually done an extra turn. So I think what we'll do is let them do their turn, and we will call it for today. Let's just see what happens here.
we figure he would move when my guy is in the truck. Smart move on his part. Damn it. Okay, well, here's where we stand. We've just still only destroyed three, and we're still here at Holder Retake. So let's go ahead and close that up. So here up north, we found out where he went. He did not move any further. We're still pulling back and, and putting up a defense for here. That one's got a defense. Uh, okay, we're pulling these guys back. Uh, we'll set up a new defensive line here. Fall, defend, fall back, defend, fall back. We now have 25 points. I'm not gonna complain about. Here in the center, we finally had to bust out our big boys. Uh, now I got my big guns available. We're gonna plow this guy. Uh, we do have units back here that we can kill. So we're going to attempt to do that in saving as many units as possible. That guy can't move any further, so it won't really matter. This guy can, and he should be able to move back here and kill something because he's a three. They're, they were a one the last time we saw him. Probably made him uh, reinforced, but. This guy, defense is here. They are moving rapidly on this. What I'm attempting to do is stem this tide. If I can take him out, that will help greatly. And that is it. So hopefully we continue playing defense. We have uh, our be our turn 10. And we got eight turns to hold out yet. And they just got troops coming upon, troops upon coming. And it's like, add a little bit at the right spots, I guess. And that will help. Wish I had something down here defending these, but I didn't think they'd get that far. That's why stemming this tide here is important. If they take this, this one, and we can stem and hold them here. We might be able to transfer some of the southern units that way. Or cut them off and force them back because they're out of supply. So 
We will have to wait and see. So we're not ending our turn. And so like I say, that is, it will be our turn 10 and we always like to save just a little extra, an extra just in case. So let's go here and exit our main menu. So hopefully, like I say, hopefully you've enjoyed today's episode. I enjoyed bringing it to you as always. Uh, defense, defense, defense. We're attempting to let them come in a little bit and surround them. They seem to be doing that to us more than we're doing it to them. But that's the way it goes sometimes. So as always, I am Captain Jake wishing you fair winds and following seas. Until next time.